Okay, I thought I'd just record a quick video on how to do these custom fan racks in Finale. So I'm going to use the, um, I've already kind of done this, so I'm going to use the uh, redo to show it to you. So if, for instance, you added a launch position to your show, then you, let's say you had a, a fan of items, so I'm going to drop in four different shells. And if you drop the four different shells, and then let's put them in a fan, you know, at this moment in time, if you were to look at the um, the launch position, so and add these racks, you're going to get four individual racks. So at this is kind of where, like you're saying, okay, I got to create a custom rack. Let me show you an easier way to create the custom rack. So if, for instance, you've got in this case, there's there's four shells. So you have um, you know a left 45, a left 15, a right 15, and a right 45. What I would do and the way I would do this is just add a rack, okay? Or what you could do is just take one of these. If you right click the rack, you can modify it. So let's say we're just gonna have four tubes in the rack. We leave everything else the same. So say you do wanna rotate it 90 degrees, um, you're gonna change it to um, each, and each, each mortar has its own angle. So we're gonna set this at minus 15, and then this one's gonna go to plus 15. And this one is going to 45. Leave this uh, module to auto. And the reason I say as soon as you change it, so notice that it will automatically move those, those items. There's no need to actually manually assign those and pull those, those uh, pins out unless you just absolutely want them to actually physically be there. So at this moment, you can highlight the auto racks that are generated and delete them. And now, now that you have this fan rack, your reports will be correct. All your descriptions will be correct. This is now a fan rack. Um, if you, as in you said in your example, if you were to use the control P, the readdress show and reassign racks, you bet if you use reassign racks at any time, Finale will delete all racks and then reallocate them. So you just no really need to reassign the racks. So you can just do readdress show. If you readdress the show and let Finale repin the show, if you go back in here just by doing readdress show, that rack will still be there. So it won't change. Um, it will uh, stay. So you don't have to recreate that each time. So hope that hopefully that helps.